In this video, I will show you how to use HTML entities function in PHP. For this, let's have the characters which are going to be used in this example to convert into HTML characters. So these are a bunch of symbols and you have copyright symbol, you have uh, some weird looking hyphen then you have foreign characters which usually get passed in UTF-8 encoding so we are going to use all these symbols and encoded characters and convert them into HTML characters so for this we are going to use HTML entities method so let's start with the code so let's create a PHP file you can use that just simply the starting and opening tags you don't have to use PHP what so if you have older version then and only you should use that so that out of the way let's create a string inside which we are going to pass this symbols characters after that let's call for let's say HTML entities method so we will just echo this and call HTML entities and then we simply pass on string make sure that there is no space okay now we will just compile this and for that let's save it on my web server which is FAM inside HT docs I'm going to save demo dot PHP okay so what we did we first grabbed characters and passed on to a string then we are echoing HTML entities and passing this string to it okay okay so let's go to the browser and type in the address so my file is demo.php so let's see what it compiles so it just converted that into exactly the type of characters I wanted to print okay so if you compile this in codepad.org you will get a different output depending on the, how HTML entities are handled Okay, so let's go for it and select PHP and then test your code and then check out the output so make sure that you have proper code in here and you have starting and closing tags okay so in case of code pad it turns you output into this NLT and copy and other tags it completely converts it into HTML characters so if your local server doesn't do this then check out this online version where it properly compiles into this code so now you know how to convert your symbols into HTML characters so you use HTML entities method and simply pass on the string or the method that you want to turn into HTML characters.